Toyota has long been a name associated with reliability, durability and innovation. In the automotive industry, the company founded in 1937 quickly rose to prominence by producing vehicles that combine quality with cutting-edge technology. Over the decades, Toyota has been at the forefront of engine development, creating some of the most legendary powertrains in automotive history. From the turbocharged marvels of the 2JZ GTE to the compact yet powerful 1.6-litre three-cylinder found in the GR Yaris, Toyota has consistently pushed the boundaries of what internal combustion engines can achieve. Now, no discussion of the Earth's engineering prowess would be complete without mentioning the 2JZ engine. Introduced in the Toyota Supra in 1991, the 2JZ GTE quickly became an icon among car enthusiasts and tuners worldwide. This 3-litre inline-six engine was designed for performance from the outset, with a cast iron block, aluminium cylinder and sequential twin turbochargers. The 2JZ GTE was capable of producing 276 horsepower in its factory form, a figure that due to the Japanese gentleman's agreement was conservative. The real magic of the 2JZ GTE, however, lies in its potential for modification. The engine's robust construction allows it to handle significantly higher power levels with minimum internal modifications. Juniors have extracted well over a thousand horsepower from this engine, solidifying its status as one of the greatest engines ever built. Fast forward to the 2020s and Toyota continues to innovate with the introduction of the 1.6 litre G16e GTS engine in the GR Yaris. This tiny power plant is a marvel of modern engineering, producing a staggering 268 horsepower and 273 pound-feet of torque from just three cylinders. Designed specifically for performance, the engine features a single-scroll turbocharger, direct and port injection, and a sophisticated cooling system to ensure it can handle the rigors of high-performance driving. And this engine too was super over-engineered, with tuners pushing this little three-cylinder to over 600 horsepower, which is insane. But Toyota is now setting its sights on a new frontier, developing the most potent 2-liter engine in the world. This new engine, which is expected to debut in models like the mid-engine Toyota MR2 and the Celica GRMN, is poised to revolutionize the automotive landscape once again. This turbocharged inline-4 engine is reportedly capable of producing up to 600 horsepower, a figure that would make it the most powerful 2-litre engine ever produced. To put this into perspective, the current benchmark in this category is the Mercedes-AMG M139 engine, which produces 416 horsepower in its most potent form. The other's new engine would not only surpass this, but would do so with significant room to spare. The engine's development is part of a collaboration between Toyota, Mazda and Subaru, with each automaker bringing its own expertise to the table. The result is expected to be an engine that not only produces immense power, but also meets strict emission regulations and is capable of withstanding electrification. This last point is particularly important as the automotive industry moves towards hybrid and electric powertrains. The ability to integrate these technologies into a high-performance engine could set a new standard for the industry. The new 2-litre engine will likely incorporate several technological innovations to achieve this remarkable power output. These could include advanced turbocharging systems such as electric turbochargers, which reduce lag and improve efficiency. Additionally, the engine may utilize stronger materials as well as being fully forged from factory to keep everything in one piece at these crazy high power outputs. But one of the key challenges in developing such a powerful engine is managing heat. High performance engines generate a tremendous amount of heat which can lead to reliability issues if not properly managed. Toyota is expected to employ advanced cooling technologies, possibly including water-to-air intercooling and sophisticated oil cooling systems to ensure that the engine remains reliable under these extreme conditions. Toyota's new 600 horsepower to lead the engine could have far-reaching implications for the automotive industry. It would set a new benchmark for power density, demonstrating that the internal combustion engine still has room for innovation in an era increasingly dominated by electrification. 
This engine could also influence the development of future high-performance hybrids as manufacturers seek to combine the best of both worlds, electrification and intercombustion, to meet emission regulations while still delivering exhilarating performance and more importantly, keeping the character and excitement of an internal combustion engine alive. Furthermore, this engine could rejuvenate interest in models like the MR2 and the Celica, which have been absent from Toyota's lineup for years. By equipping these cars with such a potent engine, Toyota could attract a new generation of enthusiasts, while also appealing to those who remember the glory days of Toyota. To end it off, Toyota has a long history of engineering excellence, and its new 600 horsepower 2-liter engine is poised to be the latest chapter in that story. Building on the legacy of engines like the 2JZ and the G16e, the new engine promises to set a new standard for performance, efficiency and innovation. But at the end of the video, please let me know what you guys thought of the video and what you guys think of this new engine. And at the end of the video, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you guys did like it, you'll most probably want some other stuff. So just go through my channel, see if there's something else to like. I'll check you guys in the next one. Cheers, I.